Gosh, it's hard to do this one handed. I said, Gosh, it's hard to do this one handed. There we go. Ah. Let's do a little half and half. Perfect. Good morning. Here's all my food for the day. Kisses. Good day. You too. Um, my coffee is two points for yeah. the half. No, it's three because I have one tablespoon of sugar. Not tablespoon. One teaspoon of sugar, and I did not get fat-free half and half. That's full fat. Grabbed it by mistake, but it's three points. Breakfast is one point of this Greek non-fat yogurt. This stuff is delicious. It's from Aldi. Um, five ounces is one point. Well, the, guys, just to be clear, I'm not doing the bites plus. This is what I'm doing. I'm really bad at answering people in my comment section on my videos. So um, I just want to show you guys. It's like the classic smart points. It's not freestyle. It's not bites plus. It's this whatever the smart one is. It's equivalent to Weight Watcher smart points before they did this whole freestyle thing. So. This is one point, I believe. Um, yes, five ounces is one point. One bite, whatever we're calling it. There we go. Um, this is two point bites. It is one one ounce of this granola. So that's breakfast with two clementines. Let me grab those. Sorry I haven't been able to film my day. It's getting harder and harder for me to do that during the week. Um, yesterday was a snow day, but I ended up watching the kids that I nanny after school. So um, that's why I, I was going to plan to film my whole day yesterday, but they called me last minute. Um, so, and during the week, it's just crazy. So fingers crossed I can get this whole video filmed and up for you guys. So there we have breakfast. I'm trying really hard, guys, because I'm just feeling so gross. I know you're so sick of me saying that, but I'm trying really hard here with tracking my food and eating less of it. So lunch here is a wrap. I have one of the tomorrow wraps, which is one point. Um, the one thing I don't like about this Bites app, I track Bites app, is like you can't just search honey ham. It says nothing found. Like it's annoying. Um, like Boar's Head Deli ham. I couldn't find it. I'm counting it as two points and the cheese is two. So that's five points for this and the apple. And then um, I'm just going to grab one of my um don't judge me this thing is this drawer is a mess it needs to be reorganized i don't even think my bars are in here i bought two bags of m&ms to make cookies for valentine's day to bring to work rob ate both bags of m&ms and this and just like that it is 7 55 and i have to go guys i will chat with you guys later these are six points by the way six bites whatever we're calling them so hello it's very much at the end of the day it is 6.28. I have nine points left for dinner. And I'm just gonna like, I have a bunch of veggies left over that I just need to cook. So I'm gonna make chicken with veggies and mix it with a pasta. Um, I'm actually making my pasta. Don't mind my dirty stove, it needs to be cleaned. Um, I'm gonna make me a gluten-free pasta and raw regular pasta. And I'm just gonna, I have these two veggies that I wanna cook before they go bad. I'm just gonna slice up the chicken, fry it up in here, and to bulk it up a bit, I'm gonna add some spinach. And I'm gonna throw spinach in mine. Rob doesn't like spinach. Hi guys, thought you'd wanna see my face. Um, I haven't done a dinner like this in forever. It's one of my favorite dinners, just throwing a bunch of veggies with some chicken and some pasta, and it should be delightful. I don't know yet if I'm gonna use my gluten-free pasta from Aldi. I also have some of the chickpea pasta. I'm gonna scan it and see if there's any point difference. Uh, I really love the chickpea pasta, and I think I've got a little left. I might use that up, but we'll see. A little dollop of olive oil again. Um, I do not count cooking with olive oil, any kind of healthy fat, just because that's silly to me. I've got my meat all seasoned up. I'm going to season it again once I drop it. I've got it seasoned with salt, pepper, garlic, and paprika, my favorite. 
And then I've got my big plate of veggies. Well, it's not that big. I just have whatever I had. I'm not gonna add this until my chicken is almost all the way cooked. And then since I only have frozen broccoli, I'm gonna steam this just slightly, not fully, and then toss it in with everything else. So let's get this in. Gotta get rid of that pork. And it's covered in raw meat. So if you're new to my channel or unfamiliar, Rob and I like our meat really well done. So the, I'm gonna cook the chicken almost, probably completely done before I add the vegetables. So I found one negative to this eye track bites. So I typed in chicken breast and nothing plain chicken breast pops up. It's like annoying. So I don't know how I'm gonna track the chicken because I don't know why it keeps coming. What is a chicken broiler or fryers? I don't understand. Uh, maybe I'll just count it as three points. I don't know. I'm a little frustrated with this. I love how whatever color is like dominant, it makes the screen look because of the poor lighting in my house. So I decided to make this pasta for myself. Two ounces is five points. And I decided to just throw in the frozen broccoli. I didn't even defrost it. I love how colorful this dinner is with all of the vegetables. It smells delicious. Add paprika to everything. You will not regret it. I love the smell. Oh my gosh, guys, look how yummy that is. So I weighed out the pasta first and I melted some melted. I um, wilted some spinach just with the pasta. And then I weighed out three ounces of chicken and then I added the veggies. I'm so excited to eat my dinner, guys. So I'm making some Valentine's Day cookies for Rob and to bring some to work for my co-workers this recipe is from a sesame street cookbook i will show you guys on the screen the recipe and it is the absolute best cookie recipe in the land screenshot this right now i make this i've been making this recipe ever since i found it in a kid's cookbook and they are the best chocolate chip cookies in the land i do not do the walnuts and um, i always add m m's to make whoa to make them like festive. I always add like the fall ones for the fall, Christmas ones for Christmas, Valentine's Day. You guys know that. I love these colored M&Ms. Esther, what are you doing in the bedroom? <clears throat> what are you doing in there? We don't go in the bedroom. Oh, I can't say no to him. We such a good boy. I just wanted to say thank you all for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I hope you all have a lovely Valentine's Day. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Hopefully I'll be able to film again. Life is crazy. I can't stop working. Do I have chocolate chip on my lip? Proof that I ate a cookie, guys. <laughs> I can't stop the eating. I did really good today, though. I can't even lie. I did really, really great. All right. I want to start editing this video so I can go to bed soon. I have one more batch of cookies to pop in the oven, and then I'm done. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.